Hey y'all, so guess what? I finally have a Timu haul. I have more things coming, but I'm not gonna sit and wait on it because I'm gonna get this video out here. I can't even remember everything that I got. I got a bunch of stuff. I think some of these have like fall shirts in here if I'm not mistaken, but let's get into it. So happy Tuesday. <coughs> Excuse me, I still have a cough. Um, I'm so excited for the weekend. I, I just want the weekend to get here where I can rest because y'all know like it's like monday hits and then tuesday hits and it's like every day feels like monday sometimes and that's the week that we're going through our work so anyways only a couple more days and it's gonna be the weekend for us so timu haul time and i was feeding my cats out here and i have this one cat his name's tuxedo sweet little cat he stole my heart and he makes sure every one of the cats have ate before he will eat and he's just the sweetest thing ever so i was doing that and i was just thinking how sweet that was i was like you're so sweet buddy um so i couldn't find my pretty little like box cutter type thing um that i got from timu so i'm having to use this which works just as good um and it's just like one of these type things. So let's see what we got here. And like I said, I can't remember like everything that I got. Um, but I do know there's some like fall stuff in here. Um, and this is a Timu shirt. It says mama on it. This is not, this little flannel thing's not Timu. I got this from like Goodwill like years ago. But I really like a lot of Timu clothes. They're like affordable, nice. Some of them are like, um, you know, not that good. But, you know, that's pretty much everything these days. So I got this sweatshirt. Ooh, this is cute. This is going to be cute with leggings. So it looks like that. And I got these super cheap. I know people's like, please um, link the product. I, I need to do that, but I, I just, I don't have time for it. Um, and not only that, the price has changed, so there's no need of me telling like the price on these things. Um, but I got that. Because as soon as I get done with this, I got to go cook. So I'm just like on it all day long and every day long. So. I'm just a busy lady, but I, I'm really forcing myself to do this video, so. Okay, now, what was this? Was this, oh, this is a little workout thing. So, I got this top. And then here's the bottoms. Nice, they're stretchy. I got this whole complete set. And then this goes over that. So this is cute, y'all. I've got to get, like, I've been working out, but I didn't last, this past week. But that goes over. So there's these, the yoga pants, this, and this little tank type thing to go underneath there. So that's, that's super cute. And I think that was like $11, $12, $13. duper cheap. Let's see what this is, friends. Oh, I thought that was that cat and that was the bag that I had there. I'm like all over the place, y'all. Um, now, what was this? Oh, so this is wild looking, but I like different, like unique things. So, I got this cute little, what would you call this? It's just like all over the place hoodie. And it's got the little hood. And it's got the flowers. It's got this. This looks like a sun to me. I don't know. I think the sun caught my attention. And then like the flowers. Um, but it's cute. It looks springish. But I would totally rock that out. Winter, fall, whenever. Just whenever I wanted to wear it. Okay, these are the. Oh my. Those look. Those look interesting. Just saying. And then I got this sweatshirt. I got some cute, I, I got all extra large because I have big, 
you know, boobs or whatever. And I like my t-shirts to kind of be bag or my sweatshirts to be baggy. Um, so this says never give up because great things takes time. And this is an extra large, but this looks like an XXL, but it's cute. This would be cute with some leggings and boots. And I love the turquoise, like blue color. This reminds me of Kathy, so get this. No, not so get this, no guts, no glory. Yeah, no guts, no glory. Um, I think that's still her, her name. I don't know if she's changed it or not, but that totally reminds me of her. And then we have, so I got some sweatpants. These are cute and it says choose happy. These are more on the baggy side because like I said, it comes with a shirt and I need extra large for shirt. I can't do large. My boobs are way too big. Um, and T-Moon sweatpants are really nice. Like, I thoroughly enjoy them. Um, I have several pants, or several pairs of their sweatpants, and they're really nice. So, and these were like eight or nine dollars, like super cheap. And then the shirt says choose happy. So, this is cute. I love it. I love their clothes. Let's see what this one is. And I still need to yet, like, get all of my summer clothes, put them away, and, like, transfer my winter clothes. Because I have, like, big, like, they're not tubs or, like, little, like, zip-up, like, bag things that's in my closet and underneath my bed. So, I need to pull all those out. Because I don't even remember what all I have, but I have a bunch of stuff. Um, I have to wear this, y'all. So, this says, Happy Hello Thanksmas. And it's got, like, Christmas stuff, it's got Thanksgiving stuff, and it's got Christmas stuff. Like, so, you know, like, when you, like, buy these top things, like, say, Christmas stuff or Halloween stuff or Thanksgiving, like, Thanksgiving or Easter stuff. So, this is, like, all in one. So, you can totally rock this out whenever. Not that I wouldn't anyways, but a lot of times, like, the Christmas shirts I don't wear, like, in the summertime or, you know, vice versa. But... All through, like, fall, winter, and all this, like, during these seasons, you can just wear the heck out of this shirt. So, I'm like, I need that. And this was, like, 3 or $4. Isn't that cute? I like that. I might wear that tomorrow. And then I got, ooh, these are nice, but rose red. These are, why are they so big? Can I wear these? Lord, I hope so. But these were super cheap. Oh, that one fell. But these these were super cheap. I think they were like on sale for six bucks, and they look like this. They look big in the bag, but I think that I might can fit these. And I got these to work out in. They're probably not that all that comfortable, but I mean, they're, you know, not too costly. So that's a good thing. And I dropped my freaking shoe down there and that cat's looking at it. Let's see what's this. It's okay, sugar britches. So that little cat's a stray cat and they're finally letting me pet them. These little white cats. And they're just now finally getting to wear, like I petted them before, but I can kind of like scoop them up a little bit and pet them. There's two white ones. Um, so they're kind of getting closer to me. They see me every day, every morning, every evening. So I love them so much. They're so sweet. I love this shirt. So this says Great Smoky Mountains National Park, eight, or 1926, I think it is. It's either 26 or 28. The, the six looks kind of messed up a little bit, but I love the Great Smoky Mountains and I love Cades Cove. And it's like a gray shirt, grayish blackish shirt. Let's see. And then I got, I'm wanting to get like a little Christmas outfit for like, normally our work has a Christmas party. I've never been to one. If they have it this year, I'm gonna go because I've worked there for like, what, four years now almost. Not been to one. I may or may not go. I don't know, but 
I'm, I thought this was cute too, but I'm, I'm, I've been eyeballing this like Christmas outfit or like a New Year's top outfit thing that's real pretty. I don't dress up a whole lot. I wear like casual stuff, t-shirts and stuff like that. So I wanted to get something dressy, but I've been eyeballing stuff. I have another order coming, but look how cute. Like, I love this little sequence, sequence type thing. And like, put like a blue jean jacket over this and some jeans. Just like, yeah, super cute. And that was like three or four dollars too as well, so. Okay, I got these socks. And what, so I told y'all before, but what I like about Timu is, so you can literally get money back, so. You get your order, you do your order, and then you go on there and click like your order and you'll see like price adjustments. When you click the price adjustments or whatever, if something went down, like say if something was like $10 and it went down to five, you'll get that extra money. That like, and it accumulates the more like, each day you can go on there and do it for like, I don't know how long, but just keep doing it until you can't do it no more. And you can accumulate quite a bit of money. Like one time I had like 80 bucks and I literally paid hardly nothing. So, I mean, it's pretty nice. So I got some Wonder Alice in Wonderland socks and these are just so cute. And I, I did order a shirt um, in Alice in Wonderland, but I've not placed the order yet, but I was looking. And then I got some of these, these were free. I, I had a few things that were free and I can't remember, but I remember these. These are some bags, some trash bags for the bathrooms. That was free. And then I got, this one was free. So this is a dryer, excuse me, a dryer sheet. So instead of having like your boxes out, um, oops. There's a decal sticker that says dryer sheets. And then look how, this is really nice. Like. So you can just put all of your little dryer sheets in this little container and put it, and it's a wood type thing. And I can't remember how much this was, but isn't that like nifty and nice? So you just put your little sticker out here and it says dryer sheets, and then you have that. So yeah, so I like really like that. But like I said, this is like not all of my haul. I'm waiting on stuff to get here, um, but I just, I have so many videos I need to do. I have like these um, pans, pots and pans that this company has sent to me. And I need pans because my pans look kind of crappy, you know. Like the Lord's blessed me with more plant, pa pans and pots or whatever. But I've not opened them up to review them because I've not had time. And, oh. I got these for free too. So, <coughs> so how, I, how I got these like three three free items so there's fish land and then like an another type thing i can't remember what it was is it fish fish land or something like that so i finally got a hundred percent and got my coupons i let the coupons expire but i got my free gifts and it took me forever um because you can get some pretty good coupons but i got that dryer sheet thing and i chose this and i chose these shoes these are different, but I like, like I said, I love different stuff, y'all. I'm a very different, unique type person. Like, I'm just, I mean, but these are cute. Um, so they look like this. I just, I just love these. Aren't those cute? Cute little boots. Um, so yeah. I got those for absolutely free. Now, they took me for a while to get them, but I got them. And then, I can't wait to put this up, too. I look a mess. I've worked all day, y'all. Um, so, this is like a paper plate holder and like fork and spoon holder for your like plastic stuff. <clears throat> and this was, so here's the thing. This was like $15 or $20 can't remember the exact price and then I got 10 or 12 dollars off of this so I paid literally half price for this um so it comes with some little these things I don't even know what that's for I'll have to look into it 
those are the knobs I think for the for this stuff let me show you so it's a place to store your paper plates and it says grab a cup let me show y'all you can put your little cups here plastic cups paper cups whatever in this thing grab a cup and drink up and this all connects together. Um, and then, I have eyeballed this for a long, long time. And I never did get it. But I'm like, you know, this would be cute. And that's got a crack. Does it look? I don't know. It kind of has a crack in it right there. A little bit. You can't really tell it. But, so it says, <coughs> grab a plate, let's eat. And there's another one that says if you grab a plate, you have to wash. If you don't grab a plate, you have to wash dishes. Something in that, like, saying. I was going to get that one, but I like this one, the wooden one. So, you put your paper plates here, and then your forks and spoons and knives there. Or if you want to put straws or whatever, because you have the drinks over here. And I don't really know how to set this up, but I'm going to set this up. But it's super cute, and I was like... I need that. And there's a marker. I guess these are the little knobs for it that you put in there. I'll have to see how you do that. But anyways, y'all, that's my Timu haul. I have had messages like, when are you going to do a Timu haul? Like, I love your Timu hauls. I've just, I've I made orders. Like, this is, like, I've had this here for two weeks now, and I've just, I've not even opened it up done a haul or anything i've just like i said i've been busy and i have more stuff coming that i've not got yet so anyways happy timu haul i love and i do still watch timu hauls i'm not this past week i've not really watched that many like youtube videos but in the past like the week before and stuff i love the timu hauls um because you never know what you can find like there's so many unique things there um, and if you look at the reviews, it pretty much gives a description on the product. Like some of the shirts that you look at the review and you can find pictures on there. So it kind of like shows what the product will look like. I like that about that. So it's a hit or miss like everything else, but I like Timu. And Timu, so when Timu come out, this company messaged me and I like, you know, reviewed it for them or whatever. But growing up, I never had, like, I would have, like, certain clothes and stuff, but I never did really get to go out and, like, shop around. I had a lot of hand-me-downs, and my aunt would buy me a bunch of cute little skirts and shirts because I couldn't wear pants growing up or whatever. And I'm, I'm very frugal. Like, I know people's like, she blows money all the time. I actually don't blow money all the time. Um, I mean, I get stuff, but I don't just go out and just drop money here and there and everywhere. Um, and I work hard for my money, but this is like, it reminds me of when I was little and I didn't have like, I would get money from my dad whenever we'd go out to like Kmart or Walmart and I'd get like little things here and there, what and a whole lot. But now it's like, man, all this stuff is super cheap and I can like get myself to buy this stuff because it's just like, I like the stuff and it's cheap and I feel like I'm just like on cloud nine getting this stuff and I don't know. It just takes me back. And I like Timu. So, um, and a lot of their stuff's such a good deal because, like I said, you can like, I'm saying like a lot. I know that. That's, I say it too much. I can't help it. But, um, like you buy this stuff and then you get like your, um, the discounted money back to put towards your next order. So it's kind of like half off and sometimes even like 70 and 80% off of, of an item because you get so much money back that you can put in your credits to use towards your next order. So, I mean, it's great. And all that I can say is Lord's been good to me. He's been good to my kids. He's been good to my family. And I'm, today I was just like out here feeding these cats and was talking to them. And I'm like, I love y'all kitty cats because... I'm, I'm with them every morning, every night, ever like in the evening times, early in the morning, and they're strays, and they're out here, they love me or whatever, but I was just thinking, you know, like, 
I'm not rich. I don't have a whole lot of money. The Lord's blessed me. He's gave me a good job. I, I can provide for my family. I don't have to worry like I used to. I used to worry so much about bills and having money and getting this for my kids and getting that for my kids. And this thing had popped up on my news feed today. Y'all, I don't want to get emotional because it will make me cry. But there was a time several years ago that... Um, I had just got a, I think I was on my second divorce. I've been divorced two times. And, um, <clears throat> freshly on my second divorce, just a very low time in my life. A very, like, hard time situation type things. And I remember finally getting this apartment. I had to wait for a while. And I prayed about it. Had people praying for it. We finally got us an apartment. Super excited about that. Got my job or whatever, which I had been working when I was with my second husband at this job. Starting out for quite some time. And, but I was at a very hard, low place in my life. And I was like financially struggling so bad. I didn't have no mom, didn't have no dad, didn't have nobody like, you know, family in my area supporting me. Like I had no one. And... Back to what I'm saying was, I was, I got this memory on my newsfeed today, and I shared it on Facebook, and it's this little black bag that has coins, nickels, dimes, pennies, you know, quarters, and all this change. Isaiah would get my coins out of my car, I'd let him, and he would like save it and put it up in this little black bag, and um, there were times I didn't have gas money, like, because I'd get paid every two weeks, and I was struggling, I was trying to figure things out. And there were a few times that I, I would run on empty and I'd pray to God, get me to where I need to go. And I, he would get me to where I needed to go. I don't, don't know how he done it, but I guess I had faith and the Lord just put that gas in there. It was all the way on empty. I should have been out 20 minutes ago at times, but the Lord seemed fit to get, to get me to and from where I needed to go. And that's a whole new story. But I remember several times going to Isaiah and being like, can I have two or three dollars? I'm going to get some of these quarters in here. Or I'd get nickels, dimes, whatever I could. Pennies. Sometimes I'd put a dollar in my tank just to try to get to where I needed to go. And he's like, yeah, you don't have to pay me back, mama. And he was just so little and tiny. And I remember doing that. And I'd be like, son, I'd say, I'll pay you back. And I'll get my check and I'll give him that money back. Even though it was mine because it was my quarters and stuff. I'd say, I'll pay you back. But that showed up on my news feed today. And I was like, man, you look back and you see the things that you've been through in life. And the things that you've overcome. And that the Lord's brought you through. And the blessings that he's gave you. At times when you were at this standing still point. That you didn't think that you could get past that or the worrying of not having enough money and the bills was like so hard on me and it was the worst stress that I've had that I've ever felt because I've like all that was new to me you know um but I was brought back to that and I was like man God's been faithful to me God's been good to me God's blessed me I don't have a whole lot of money I'm, I'm not rich but I can say for once in my life that I've got a good job. I make good money. And I'm not bragging by no means. But he's been, God's been good to me. And he's been faithful to me. And I'm just so thankful. A lot of times we let life get in the way. And we like just all of the negativity in the world. And the hurt and the bitterness and the angry of things that's happened to us in our life. We forget of the blessings that he's given us now. And today I was feeding these cats and I was like, man, you know, I have so much to be thankful for and God's blessed me and my kids and I'm thankful for that. I'm thankful for everything that he's done and he's going to continue to bless me. Like one day I want to have my own house that's mine out somewhere in the country and I can have my animals and all my stray animals and just love them and just, you know, live life. But until now, this is what I have. And I'm thankful for all of that. I didn't mean to get onto that, but that was on my mind. Um, 
So to wrap this up, you might be struggling. You might be going through a hard time and you might feel like the weight of the world's on your shoulders and all these bills are piling up and you don't know what you're going to do. Hang tight because you know what? Storms don't last forever. Tomorrow's going to be a new day. The sun's going to come out. It's going to start shining. And the next day may not be any easier because I lived it day in and day out for, Lord, quite some time. Quite some time. I couldn't eat. I couldn't sleep. I was losing weight. But I got through it because I, I just, I kept the faith. Even, even when I felt like my faith was gone, I had that hope that everything was going to be okay. I held on to the Lord was going to take care of us, and he did. And you know what? We, each of us, have come way too far to turn back, to walk away. We have to be thankful for now and what we have now and, and be thankful that, you know, God will always make a way for us. And sometimes in little rough patches become a blessing. Excuse me. Back then it was hard. But to see in what I had overcome with that situation was a blessing to my heart. And sometimes we have to be, sometimes we have to remind ourselves of those things. And Isaiah still has that little black bag that has coins in it that he puts coins in. Um, God's good. God's faithful. I love Timu. I love getting their little stuff on there. Thanks for watching. And until next time, guys, I will talk to you guys later. Bye.